Hey guys, it's MCK here, back with another video, and today I am reviewing Slipknot, The Grey Chapter. Their latest release came out two weeks ago, I believe. Um, it's a, it's incredible CD, honestly. I love it. My favorite song is Cust, uh, yeah, Custer. A lot of people like that one. It also has their latest song, The Devil and I. And the negative one. Both of them have been on the radio. And actually, this is the back. If you can see it. There we go. Uh, it's in, The CD brings you back to the Iowa Slipknot. It's fantastic. It's definitely better than All Hope is Gone. It's, it's a good comeback for them not to have a CD in six years. This is actually the new masks. You can see it. No crappy lighting right now. But the inside is just... Uh, lyrics and then it has uh an image of every single one of the band members the big controversy with this album was actually that it sounded a lot like uh sound store uh no sorry stone sour house of gold i disagree honestly this is a million times different from stone sour just because uh cory taylor's in both bands doesn't mean they're identical i honestly think slipknot's better than stone sour but to think, for them to literally come back from having nothing and bringing out the CD, I mean, it went to Billboard number one the very first week, which is hard to do for metal these days, so. Honestly, you need to get this. If you are a metalhead, you need to bring out, you need to support them. I mean, it's obviously tough to write an album. There's a brand new bass player, there's a brand new drummer. A uh, drummer has not been announced. Bass player has, I forgot his name. Um, both of them still need to earn their way into officially being a member into Slipknot, but I think they'll both make it in because the drumming on this CD is fantastic, the bass is good rhythm, so. This is actually the CD case, you can see it. Um, it has their new logo in it, but it's really hard to see because it's only engraved in. But, overall, it's a good pickup, I would definitely get it. It's good for any metalheads. Oh, they're definitely coming back. They just had not fast. They're doing a huge um, tour with Korn. So I'm sure we'll be hearing a lot more from Slipknot in the future. And hopefully this will be a good run. And every two or three years, we'll have a new album from them until they finally call it quits. So that's my review. Make sure you like and thanks for watching.